What is up, guys? Midnight Sun 518 here, back with another episode of uh, Detroit Become Human. So, yeah. We are back here with Connor, um, and I don't really know how we got here, but uh, we are. And this looks like a massive Zen garden. Find Amanda, huh? I was expecting it to play uh, whatever intro cutscene again, but it didn't, so this is uh, this is where we are. Ooh, hello, bird. Do I want to go this way? I want to go over the bridge. This is so cool. Man, this is absolutely gorgeous, guys. Check out these flowers on this, uh, is that like a lilac tree? A little bit of a rose bush or something. You got the cattails there. Man, it's so cool. Man, and just look at the water, too. They got shadows going on the water. The water literally looks like it's flowing, like it's moving. Man, this is crazy cool. Echo, turn on the gaming disc. Uh, yeah, this is crazy cool. So pretty. I don't know what this weird tree thing is, but I'm digging the vines that are on it. Can I talk to you? Where are you? Hello. Ah, oh, you're Amanda. Connor. That's me. Good to see you. Congratulations, Connor. For what? Finding that deviant was far from easy. Mm. And the way you interrogated it was very clever. Yep. You've been remarkably efficient, Connor. Efficient? Thank you, Amanda. We've asked Not the sure BPD like that to talk. transfer it to us for further study. It may teach us something about what happened. The interrogation seemed challenging. Mm -hmm. What did you think of the deviant? He was scared. Oh yeah, there it is, traumatized. It showed signs of PTSD after being abused by its owner. As if its original program had been completely replaced by new instructions. This... Interesting. Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the deviancy case. What do you make of him? Uh... He's an interesting person. I think he's irritable. And socially challenged. But I also think he used to be a good detective. Used to. He's an intriguing character. Unfortunately, we have no choice but to work with him. Mm -hmm. What do you think is the best approach? To work with him, I guess. I will adapt to his personality. It is in the best interest of the investigation that I avoid conflict and try to accommodate his psychology. Mm. Like that. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. You're the most advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. Am I? If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. You bet. You can count on me, Amanda. Hurry, Connor. There's little time. Little time for what? Apocalypse? Robots taking over? Could happen. Look for Lieutenant Anderson. Hank, where you at? Hank? Can I help you? I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Yes. Mm, yeah. Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. Thank you. Where's his desk? Tensions in the Arctic have reached a new level. Ooh. A Russian carrier and an American patrol boat reported to have flashed last night. Several warnings. Hey. Take a look at these samples yet? Detective Reed. My report says they cut it. Not bad. Brown. Pearson. Collins. There it is. I found your desk, bud. Now, where are you? Excuse me. Do you know what time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives? Depends on where he was the night before. If we're lucky, we'll see him before noon. Thanks. Hmm. 
I wonder what happened to him. What turned him into this? Explore new office. Okay. So much for sitting. Let's check his desk out. What you be listening to, fam? Some rock. Knights of the Black Death. Interesting. Release date 2021, though. That's, that's fun. Call Hank Anderson. Hi, this is Hank. Not here at the moment. Mm. You can leave a message if that's what turns you on, but don't expect me to call back. Beep. Whatever. Lieutenant leave Anderson, this is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. It's almost noon, and I'm this waiting for Connor. you at the office. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. Like, bro, we know who you are. If we didn't know who you were, then, uh, I guess, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know what I'm trying to say. Baseball cap. Detroit. I guess, or not baseball, I say that, basketball. We don't bleed the same color. Nope. I'm an android. Jimmy's Bar. Some matches from Jimmy's Bar, huh? Red Ice Task Force 2027. I see Hank in the middle. Potentially comfy chair. Canine hairs. St. Bernard. You can tell that just by looking at it. It's crazy. That is a lot of donuts. <laughs> I like how it lists out the fats and, and the carbs. And Japanese maple. Man, that shit looks dead as fuck. You need to add some water to that. And a really, really old traces of coffee. Really old coffee. Alright. Hello. It's good to see you again, Lieutenant. Oh, Jesus. Hank! In my office! Enter and listen, uh, I want to explore the office. Let's look at this. Detroit today! Oh my god! It's Carl! Oh. Yep. Carl Manfred, one of Detroit's, Detroit's brightest lights, reports a famous artist's uh, death has been confirmed. The coroner described a fatal cardiac event in, uh, induced by a stressful d domestic situation. Manfred's son, Leo, had asked the media to respect his family's privacy in this difficult time. Yeah, but we know he did it. It was him the whole time. It's terrible. It is absolutely terrible. Auctioning his paintings in the coming weeks? Interesting. Ivanov says yet. Yeah. Why does he say yet? Former President Warren's demand that all Russian troops withdraw from the Arctic. Why are the Russians in the Arctic? That's crazy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, I'm done with it. Yet. Man, why is he getting yelled at? We already did all that. Man. What are you being an asshole, bro? Stop yelling. Archive, man. I'm just going to go in here for a minute. Am I authorized? Oh man, it's this guy. Hello. Man, you need a shower. They're going to destroy me. Yep. Well, let's be compassionate. I think he I'm needs sorry. It. It's not what I wanted. But there's nothing I can do.
I know there's something you didn't tell me. I need to know before they take you away. Statuette. The sculpture you made. Tell me more about it. I'm going to die. Let me know, bud. I'm sorry. Jailbreak? Okay. So he's unresponsive. Hello? Who did that? Open the cell, quick! Hurry! Why? Bruh. I'll call Cyberlife. Uh huh. Clean this mess up. Can I go in? Or, or just close it. That's cool too. Huh. Okay. That was not what I thought would ever happen, but that's fun. Who are you, man? What? What are you looking at? I'm looking at you. Hey, fuck you. Fuck you, too. Fuck you. All right. I'm just going to keep looking and see if he says something else. No? Ooh, can I go this way? What's in here? Oh, interrogation room. Who are we interrogating? Nobody? Okay. Check on Hank. What if I don't want to? I want to go to the break room. Any snacks? Look at that. Our friend, the plastic detective, is back in town. Hello. Congratulations on last night. Very impressive. Thank you. <laughs> Hello. My name is Connor. Let me enter it. See if I said it. What? No, he didn't say it. Why not? <laughs> How do I know who I've you are? Were like you before. How do I know if you Hello. were sent by Cyberlife or not, bro, if you don't tell me? RK-800. I'm a prototype. A prototype? Yeah. Android detective. So machine's gonna replace us all. Nope. Is that it? Just work with you. Hey, bring me a coffee, dipshit. How about, uh... Get a move on! How about no? I, I gave you an order. I'm sorry, but I only take orders from Lieutenant Anderson. Oh, oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. If Hank hadn't gone the way yesterday, I would have fucked you up for disobeying a human. Mm -hmm. Stay out of my way. Nah. So next time, you won't get off so easy. Maybe I'll kill you too. Man, screw that guy. What an asshole. Several sources report that CyberLife has provided Detroit police with a prototype detective android. Although police assistant androids mm. have existed for several years now, this would be the first case of an android being authorized to play an active role in criminal investigations. I don't see a problem we with that. We contacted CyberLife for comment, but no one was available to answer our questions. Yeah, because you're bullshit. Ah, right. What's in here? Why are you looking at me? Can't go that way.
Hank. Somebody died. Uh, understand. I get the impression my presence causes you some inconvenience, Lieutenant. I'd like you to know I'm very sorry about that. Mm hmm. Let's be positive. In any case, I'd like you to know I'm very happy to be working with you. I'm sure we'll make a great team. Mm. Is there a desk anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. Thank you. Analyze the desk. I like analyzing the desk. I got my own desk, guys. It's so cool. Got a big screen, dog, basketball, music, anti-androids. Uh, I want to ask about you your have a dog, right? How do you know that? I saw the hair. The dog hair's on your chair. I like dogs. Dogs are What's cute. What's your dog's name? What's it to you? Just making conversation, man. Sumo. I call him Sumo. Talk about basketball? Let's do music. Do you I listen like to Knights of the Black Death? I really like that music. It's full of energy. You listen to heavy metal? Well, of course I, don't I really do. I'm an android. To music as such. But I'd like to. And he doesn't question why you chose that band of everything. Let's talk about basketball. You're a Detroit Gears fan, right? Denton Carter scored 53% of his shots from the three point line yesterday. Did you see the game? That's what working. I was watching at the bar last night. Oh. Why would he get upset about that? A lot of people don't appreciate having androids around. I was wondering, is there any reason in particular you despise me? Yeah, there is one. Why don't you want to tell me and why are you getting mad at me? I'm sorry. If you have any files on Deviants, I'd like to take a look at them. The terminal's on your desk. Knock yourself out. I got a computer. Access. Missing. Some guy. Suspect. Some guy. Suspect. Some guy. So, uh, missing another guy, destroyed, suspect. Ooh! Look at that. We know who that is. Two hundred and forty three files. Jeez. First dates back nine months. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. An AX four hundred is reported to have murdered a man. That could mm -hmm. be a good starting point for our investigation. No, leave her alone. She hasn't done anything. Well, she may have murdered somebody, but, you know. He's an asshole. Come on. I understand you're facing personal issues, Lieutenant. But you need to move past them. And hey, Man. don't talk to me like you know me. I'm not your friend, and I don't need your advice, okay? I was gonna say, those are not the words to say there. Uh, determined or resign the mission? Is they determined? I don't know what that means, but... I've been assigned this mission, Lieutenant. I didn't come here to wait until you feel like working. Damn. What an asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. But things are gonna get nasty. Oh, uh, Lieutenant? I'm sorry to disturb you. I have some information on the AX-400 that killed the guy last night. Mm. It's been sighted in the Ravendale district. I'm on it. I am not scoring a lot of points with Hank today, am I? 
Seemed like every single thing I was doing was making mad. Son of a gun. I guess that's really the only path that you could have gone, huh? Hank is mad, yeah. It's the only way to get there. I wonder what that other one is, though. Interesting. Well, uh, that was quite the experience. Uh, <laughs> you know, uh, I don't I don't really know what else to say about that one. We had to check out a police station, so I guess that's kind of cool. Uh, I really like that garden in the beginning. Um, I kind of wish that we could have walked around a little bit more. But, uh, I don't know. I guess that's all that they wanted us to do. Let's go! Do the next one. Enjoy. Enjoy what? Good morning! Kara, you need to not be an android anymore. You need to take the thing off your head and change your clothes. Revive the fire. Check on him. You doing okay? Good morning. Man. Pass the hell out. I already revived the fire. Well, I guess maybe I need more wood. More paper. Why is there another newspaper? Wild. Oh, sorry. Cyber Wildlife. Ooh. Android Zoo, huh? That's pretty cool. Polar bears. That's it. Canada, still android free. Of course they are. Why wouldn't they be? I don't feel like reading that. Is this a wire cutter familiar? What is this? Oh, wood. What? This was here the whole time? I had to, like, pick wood up off of the floor in some random place last night? This is stupid. Yep. Check out the kitchen. What is this? Interesting. Urban farm area. Urban field something. I don't know. If that's supposed to mean something to me, it definitely does not. RA9. I'm alive. Oh my god. RA9 is everywhere. Everywhere. Jeez. It's just a dead bird laying here. Okay. It is long dead. That thing's stiff as fuck. Broken watch. Look, we got monies. Can I have it? Definitely stealing all of this. It's probably gonna bite me in the ass, but you know. We're gonna need it. Mm -hmm. Let's go upstairs. Yep, nothing we can do with it. Can I go upstairs? Bro, you gotta get rid of the ring on your face. Find new clothes. Yep. And where's the uh, crazy guy? Probably locked in the bedroom. Anything in here? Nope. Okay. About in here. It's bad though. Probably that would have been uh, better to have. Why is there a massive hole? Eastern Motel. 
Ooh, the closet. New clothes. Anything in here? There's a jacket. It works. You're telling me all there is is a jacket and you're completely changing out of everything? That's interesting. Great dynamics game. Stylish. Now you gotta get rid of the circle on your face. Her hair and and get rid of the circle too. Come in again. I guess we're going to the bathroom now. That's where you cut hair, right? No. Nope. Trim, trim, trim. Snip, snip, snip. It's called an emo cut. In the mirror with a pair of scissors. I assume androids can't grow their hair back, so... It's permanent, lady. She don't care. Blonde, white, black. white. That's weird. Let's go blonde. Can I look at all of them? I want to look at all of them. The white's pretty cool. I really, I think I like the look of the white the best, honestly. Isn't that pretty cool? Yeah, we're going to do that. I'm going to stick with the white. Okay, that we need to turn off. Yep, remove. Oh, right bumper. Let's hit the left one. Yep, just using some scissors. Hmm. I'm not an android anymore, according to people. Now we need to leave. Ooh, I can open that. Hello? Ooh, okay. He is definitely murdered. We need to leave. Ooh, those are the cops. Okay. That's Connor and Hank. That's all for now. Here you go. We've got officers sweeping the neighborhood in case anybody saw anything. Okay, well, let me know mm. if they turn anything up. What are you going to do with that? I have no idea. Why are you talking in hush tones? Say it to my face. It took the first bus that came along and stayed at the end of the line. Its decision wasn't planned. It was driven by fear. Mm -hmm. Androids don't feel fear. Deviants yeah, do. They do. They get overwhelmed by their emotions and make irrational decisions. All right, well, that still doesn't tell us where it went. It didn't have a plan, and it had nowhere to go. Maybe it didn't go far. Dang it, Connor. You're supposed to let Kara go. <laughs> Ralph found Mr. to feed the little girl. Uh, it's good for her. A present. To make up for past misunderstandings. <laughs> we're Ralph good. will cook. We will do just like humans do. Humans like burnt meat. Come. Come and sit down. <laughs> Ralph, I think we need to leave. That's very kind of you, Ralph. But we Wait, have sir, to go. Go away. Go. <laughs> No, you will go once the little girl is eaten. We will eat together, just like a family. Father, the mother, and the little girl. Uh-huh. <laughs> Bro, no, we gotta go. We're leaving now. Come on, Alice. Uh -huh. The little girl's going nowhere. I 
I'm gonna shoot this guy. Uh, explain. Humans don't eat that often. <laughs> Humans eat dead animals. I know that. You're not going to hurt her, are you? Mm -hmm. We're friends. We are. Remember? Not, but keep playing that game, man. No, Ralph doesn't want to hurt the little girl. He just wants her to eat. That's all. Well, she doesn't want to eat that. Okay. We'll eat together. Like a family. <laughs> That's better. <laughs> Ralph went to a lot of trouble to find something for the little girl to eat. Mm -hmm. It wouldn't be polite for her to refuse. Would it? Hello. <laughs> Say hi, Jennifer. Great. 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 <laughs> I don't know where you're trying to go here, Kat. Succulent, you'll see. Succulent. Right. <laughs> Thank you for clawing my shoulder. Father, mm -hmm. mother, little girl. Please, Carl. I don't want to eat that. What yeah, did nobody say? does. She said she can't wait to eat it. She's very hungry. The mm -hmm. little human is not going to regret it. <laughs> Ralph found the best, the biggest one he could find. <laughs> this is going to be succulent. Succulent. <laughs> Go ahead. Eat. That's disgusting. <laughs> Let's uh, ask about the corpse. I saw the body upstairs. No, oh, that's not what I thought you he meant. You killed that human, didn't you? No. No, he was like that when Ralph found him. You killed that man, Ralph. There's no point in lying. You hate humans, but you're just like them. You're a murderer. Ralph didn't mean any harm. Mm-hmm. No. It's just that... We're gonna end up Stupid. pulling the gun on the sky, pulling the trigger, and that's gonna alert the freaking cops, isn't it? I was sorry. He just wanted to be your friend. Mm. I feel for the guy, but not Anybody somebody I don't want to be hanging around. Oh shit! There's blue blood on the fence. I know another android was here. I don't want to be playing both characters. This is messed up, man. I like them both. I don't want Kara to get arrested. Because then there's no way to take care of Alice. Man, this is messed up. Ah, oh, no. Ralph, take one for the team, buddy. Ooh, Pete. Let's get him. Android inside the house. I see Ralph! Oh, man. Knock, knock. Hello. Right trigger. He is deviant. I know that. Software instability. Moderate. Why do these guys just self-destruct? I don't get that. WR600 Gardener. What are missing? Interesting. Burn mark. Is that what that is? Pretty sure. Don't be I don't want him to explode. I'm not gonna hurt you. There's blue blood on the fence. I know another android was here. Ralph scratched himself coming through. That's Ralph's blood. Are 
Are there any other androids here? I really any? don't want to push. I just want to let it go, man. No. Baffles him up. Is he? I'm looking for an AX-400. Why do I have to ask all the questions? Ralph's seen nobody. Okay. Ah. Interesting. Perfect tool to cut a wire fence. Androids don't need heat. Come on, I want to look at the table. I want I want to look at the table. Table set for 3. Let's look in here. More RA9 everywhere. Yep. Stairs. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Is anyone upstairs? No. Nobody. Android is telling the truth. That means that they're not in the house. Coming, Lieutenant. Thank God. Can I leave? I'm the source of the stress. Stressed out about me. So I can't go upstairs. I don't get it. very not stressed over here, but he's very stressed when I'm next to the game. Stop her? Good. Glad. I'm trying to run here. I don't want to run. I want to let him go. Please let them escape. Please let them escape. They're over there! Stop! I'm here to help you. Frogger? This is seriously messed up. Oh, fuck. That's insane. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God, no! Oh. No! Hey, where are you going? I can't let them get away. They won't. 
and never make it to the other side. I can't take that chance. Now hey, you will get yourself killed. Do not go enough. after him, Connor. That's an order. Let him go. I want him to escape. It's so bad. Oh my god. Jesus. No! I totally thought she was going to get hit right there. Oh, man. Are you okay? Hmm. Damn. That'll get the juices flowing, won't it? Wow. Holy cow. There are so many pathways in this one, man. I want to know what this what these top ones are. Morning in squat. Oh, these must be like if you chose to sleep in the car or the the motel or something like that. That must be what these are. Interesting. Man, we got so much. Yep, that's the hair. Change clothes. Ah, oh, we could have left the gun, I guess. Huh. Well, that was quite quite a long one. Um, and I, I really enjoyed that. That really got my heart going. Because, um, you know, I feel for uh, Kara and, or Kara and um, Alice. It was a little jarring there when uh, the other dude is not letting him go, but, you know, um, I guess he eventually kind of turned out to be sort of a good guy. I don't know. He's a little unstable, so. Anyways, uh, man, I'm really enjoying this game, and I hope you guys are too. I'm sorry this episode's running a little bit long, but uh, it is what it is. Sometimes when you're into it, you gotta go, you know what I mean? Uh, but with that, hope you guys have enjoyed. Midnight Sound out.